Good morning, Hero Wars fans. In this video, I'll try to answer a question from a viewer in the comments section about how much time I spend playing each day. My current playing time is about 20 minutes for routine work, and another 15 minutes for strategy planning for guild battles. That's the minimum amount of time I need to play each day, but I also spend some time thinking about Hero Wars, so I guess that's about 2 hours total. The amount of time I spend playing per day will vary depending on how long I am home. I think the majority of people play games while watching TV or YouTube videos, and at the same time. In the case of this game, I think I spend more time thinking about team building and such than I do about arenas, guild fights, campaigns, and towers. Let's talk about Valkyrie's Favor. Valkyrie's Favor is an absolute must-have when playing Hero Wars. Without Valkyrie's Favor, you'll spend an inordinate amount of time playing campaign maps, towers, titan dungeons, etc., so it's a must-have. When I first started playing Hero Wars, I didn't even use the rating feature, I played all the game elements completely by hand. In that case, there were days when my daily playing time reached 3 hours. Even when I received 500 energy as a free gift, I still felt like, wow, I need an hour just to consume that, so to be frank, playing without using the raid function and the speed up button in battle is not recommended. Even if you play Hero Wars as a trial game at first, if you chose to continue playing this game as a hobby, the raid function and Valkyrie's favor are a must. To use a fishing analogy, it's like digging for worms for an hour in the riverbed because you don't want to have to pay for the bait needed to go fishing. I still remember how painful it was to spend time in Titan dungeons and Titan tournaments when I didn't have the raid feature and the speed up button. Let me tell you about the time I spent thinking. I think most people who play Hero Wars have the most fun when they are thinking. For me, it's when I'm in the bath thinking, what's the event this weekend? In the bathroom. From the conversations on Discord.com, it seems that many players are attracted to the strategic aspects of Hero Wars. In the case of Hero Wars, the more I learn about the game system and the characteristics of the heroes, the more I am amazed at the depth of the game. I've reached a level where I can see the characteristics of team composition, and I'm impressed with the game balance of Hero Wars. Let's talk about that feeling that doubles the fun. When you play Hero Wars, there will come a time when you will have to tell your heroes that they are not good enough. To give you a concrete example, it's the moment when you strip away the elemental gifts from a hero you've been training and believe to be promising, the moment when you decide, I'm not going to spend any more resources on you. I feel that the regret and despair I feel in those moments adds a spice of fun to Hero Wars. Now, it's time for the video to end. If you've ever been disappointed by Galahad, please subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching the video until the last part. I'll see you in my next video.